you can make it today. Hi, I'm Jimmy Stewart. Hey, what are you doing? Don't, don't, don't do that. Oh, uh, that door lock. Ah, uh, uh, lock Canada is back in the house. Uh, how do I get out of here? Oh, oh, finish the intro. That's it. That's it. Hi, right, I'm Jimmy Stewart, the creator of the Vancouver Bean Movie Factory, and uh, let's go take a look at the other guy. Yeah, yeah, doors open. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You're here. That's good. Introduce yourself. Hi, I'm Carlo, and I'm the Talented Coordinator. Hello, I'm Scott Taylor. I am Supreme Commander over all things digital. And I'm Richard. I'll be the director of this here film. My name is Craig, and I'm the Inspiration. And I'm Jimmy Stewart, and this is the Vancouver Bee Movie Factory. <laughs> Guys. What? Mm -hmm. Cool thing that we have right now, it's an all-star panel. We have yeah, like the, so. the host of Indie Action. Yay! Toasty, the robot from Indie Action. And Carlo, who is <laughs> on the Green Arrow. I saw that episode, dude. Yes. You did really good. <laughs> talking, that, that was a great talking part. And you were also a thug on one of the Crazy Eights films that was just happening right now? Yes. Basically, I just play thugs now. <laughs> <laughs> and the dead guy on Black Hills. Yeah. And the dead, <laughs> dead guy on Black Hills, yes. Yes, I got to eat you. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <That was so>. <laughs> Awkward. <laughs> okay. But yeah, all star studded panel. I love it. Wow. And I guess we can go home now. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> we have Locked Canada here to be our inspiration. Tell us more about that. We're excited to have you guys making films uh, locked again. Of course, we've got new rooms for you guys to film in. Nice. So, lots of options. I'm excited to see what you guys are going to do. Do you guys have any ideas yet? Well, <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> it depends. I mean, uh, it's, not, it's not unusual for this group to have ideas. We have, we have lots of them, and even one or two of them might even be OK once in a while. Um, so, but we do have an idea, and it involves, uh, it's simple, you, you, know, you ever wonder what is, and this is really for the, the ladies out there, when, when your guy is, is listening to you, do you ever wonder what's actually going on in his head when you ask him, are you listening? <laughs> well, this is going to cover that in about five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's romantic, it's, it takes us down perhaps the path of, of an archetypal character. It shows us the dynamic between man and woman, uh, or, and woman, I suppose. Um, it's also a little bit funny, and it has a twist, and some gun foo. Well, we've had lots of crazy things happen at Logs Canada, but I've never seen gun foo. Gun foo, wow. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's gonna be awesome. Like, have you ever seen The Matrix? It won't be like that, but... <laughs> <laughs> and you have that hallway. I know locked pretty well now. So there's a hallway that I want to make use of, and, and then your rooms are always fantastic, so any of those rooms will be, will be lots of fun. And then I've got a couple different ways of being able to, to be able to do... I've planned too much. Yeah. So, <laughs> so let's forget that I said any of that. What do you guys want to do? <laughs> Let's do something with gun fu. Oh, it's a good idea. <laughs> and yes, Carlo, I mean, we need someone who looks like you, acts like you, and does everything that you do. Do you know anyone? Hmm. <laughs> who looks a lot like the guy that I saw when we were doing the coverage at Crazy Eights at the Science uh, World after party, who was dressed sharp and responded to Carlo. You don't have like a twin brother or someone we can I use. <laughs> could find somebody Good. off the streets, maybe. Good, <laughs> awesome, yeah. yeah. Just keep your eye out, you know. I'll do that. <laughs> so, from Locke's point of view, what are you, what are you guys able to help us do to help make this film? Um, our newest room, I believe you guys will be shooting in, is going to be called Criminal Mind. 
Ooh. So that is a murder theme. Nice. Yes. Yeah, so maybe a psychological thriller. Um, Do you still have the handcuff rubber room? <laughs> we've got handcuffs. Wow. Absolutely. Kind we've got broken handcuffs. Yeah. Uh, if you need broken handcuffs, I can't imagine why you would, but if you do need them. Uh, and that padded room is still there. That's one of our most popular themes. Yes. Yeah, it's just a great room. Yeah. It's got a good atmosphere in there, yeah. Yeah. I don't remember how every room empties into the hallway exactly. Right. Uh, but there's a, a kind of framing that I'd like to pull off that would be, that would just look neat. You know, there's a lot, a lot of this is, it, the idea behind it also is to be highly stylized. It's, essentially, as I was explaining to Scott, is it, um, in addition to being um, about an archetypal hero and the, <laughs> the stuff between a man and a woman, etc., and the joke and whatnot, is essentially sort of like a five minute music video in a lot of ways. So incredibly stylized um, and very, very cut to music and, and all that sort of stuff. So it should sort of play and feel uh, probably not that far off of, a, of a, a, a rock song or rock video or something like that. I'm going to shoot it high frame rate so it's going to look good. What, what do you even like the idea? Of I, li I like the idea of the music video and I like the gun foo. Oh, yeah. I'm excited to see that. Uh, we actually have some good gun props we can bring along as well, so they're going to look pretty badass. That's kind of like kung, <laughs> kung fu with guns. Yep. This is what I'm imagining. Yeah. Okay. Interesting. Wow. It's Do you actually shoot the guns or are you just kind of trying to hit each other with them? Oh, there's a hell of a lot of shooting and death in this one. Oh, wow. It's a lot of post work for sure. <laughs> wow. <laughs> a lot of people's brains blowing up and stuff like that, but all very sort of cool. And that's all CGI. A lot, all that is. Yeah. All that is. <laughs> well, muzzle flashes and in. things like that. <laughs> Scott, you do the magic, all the magic? Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and he's just realizing now <laughs> I might all have the a things. <laughs> yeah. I'll put I just shoot this <laughs> kid, right? I, I help him do the edit, and then it's like post work. <laughs> and then color grading. Yes, that'll and be fun. music and composing. And yeah. <laughs> Help! <laughs> <laughs> It'll be a great day. <laughs> and I'll be like, why did I say I'd do this? So you guys want to pitch this to the guys tomorrow? Sure. Sounds good? Do it. Okay. <laughs> All right. Stay tuned. <laughs> Stay tuned. Richard Scorgey and me, his robot Toasty, as we banter on our space station while showing Vancouver independent films and how they are made. Check your local listings for airtimes on Shaw TV. See you next time. The gang is here at Locked, and we're going to figure out what we're going to do. So, welcome to Locked, and this is what we're going to do. Yes, we're going to do things for television. The new Shaw show, or the next Shaw show. And Carlos will tell you what it is. Yes, it is a film about great epic proportions. <laughs> okay, well, um, basically, there's a guy with a gun, and it's based on gun, gun fu, we call it. It's a mix of like. Yada, 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 yada. A lot of talking. But I'd like to take a look around locked. Hi, Wendy. All right, guys, you ready to see some options, some inspiration? Yeah! yeah. All right, let's do it, guys. Follow me this way. Okay. We've never been <laughs> definitely an option here. Check it out. Oh, my dear. Hello. Oh, nice. I have to let that kick around in my brain for a while. There's something about this room. Hmm. All right, guys, here's another option for us. One. Now, if here's you've got more open space, you can do probably more action movies. All right, guys, are you ready for a challenge? I'm going to lock you guys up, OK? Follow me this way, guys. Are you guys ready for your challenge tonight? Yeah! Woo! Okay guys, I'm gonna start your timer. Good luck and have fun.
Hooray! We won! Team. Yeah! Oh, I missed up. Lock of shame. Yeah, you don't need that, you're back in the real world. Yeah. So guys, and gals, <laughs> what do you think? Great. and me, his robot Toasty, as we banter on our space station while showing Vancouver independent films and how they are made. Check your local listings for airtimes on Shaw TV. See you next time. It's shooting! It's just a quick elevator ride to the second floor. People are signing in and going straight to makeup. Okay, we, we, we just arrived at Locked, and uh, it's unbelievable. They've got the first scene started. Let's watch. Okay. So he's like, Carlos! <laughs> Carlos! <laughs> Are you even listening to me? Yeah. So, then Sarah said, and, and she said like, oh my God, and then that's what Jenny said, and it's like, and let's be done, it's like, you know what I mean? And it's like, yeah, that's how I totally hope. And that's like, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> okay? Action. Carlo. Carlo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that's, that's better. And action. Carlo. Carlo, are you even listening to me? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> God, that's perfect. Oh, man, they did those first two scenes real quick. And now it's time to move into the new room, Criminal Mind. Let's watch. Cash rolling. So I did? No. Yeah, hold. Neither. <laughs> and action. Great. Okay. Lovely. And action. Fantastic, okay, great. Okay, they're three hours in and Richard is doing really well. All that's left is this hallway scene and it's really dark in here. I don't know what I can shoot, but uh, I'm gonna try. Let's see what I see. It's so dark, I'm gonna have to use night vision. Uh, doesn't look so good and uh, he's scaring me with those guns, so... I'm out of here. It seems everyone's gathering out in the lobby. Let's uh, see what Richard has to say. There's only one thing left to say. Say it, say it. Lunch. <laughs> That's a wrap, people. Woo! Woo! Yeah. Okay, um, it was said it was a wrap and uh, I suggested they do another scene and they locked me up, locked me up in here. You don't have to worry about that. All you have to do is to... Watch our film! Yeah! Pizza's good. <laughs> Come join Richard Scorgi and me, his robot Toasty, as we banter on our space station while showing Vancouver independent films and how they are made. Check your local listings for airtimes on Shaw TV. See you next time.
Welcome back. Well, guys, Lock Canada couldn't be with us because they've got so much to do, so many people to lock up. <laughs> They're locked in. But I really like to thank Lock Canada for having us out there. And uh, don't forget to go out to see their new room. Uh, Was it Criminal Mind? Yeah, that's a cool new room, and it's opened now. So get out there. Simon's been busy. Yeah, Simon has been busy. So, guys, it was very interesting. I showed up on the shoot day. And we were doing gung fu. Yes. And we had no guns. None. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys want to watch the film? No. No. Okay. no, no. All right, cool. So thanks I for wanted to, seen it. Hang on. I just, <laughs> well, I just wanted because I know after the film we just wave goodbye, and I just wanted to thank uh, Carlo for doing a great job, Rochelle for doing a great job. Everybody who was on set that day was was great. I'd like to thank you know, Simon and crew for uh, giving us the location. It was tons of fun. Pizza was good again. And um, and everybody who worked on the film post-production just did such a bang-up job. Uh, mm -hmm. So I just want a, a big thanks to them. Made, makes, uh, makes what I did so much better. <laughs> <laughs> we had a good workflow. Well, yeah, yeah. Good. I mean, uh, between sound effects, visual effects, uh, you and me spotting and doing editing together came together nice, and uh, I'm just a little bit proud of the music too. So, mm. <laughs> so guys, you want to watch the film? Yeah. Okay. We've never seen it. <laughs> <laughs> How about in the control room? You ready in there? Yeah. Excellent. Let's do this. Roll it.
Well, anyways. And then she said, like, no. And I said, well, yeah, obviously. And then I go, yeah, you know, right? And then Marcy says, yeah. And I said, no way. I said, oh, yes way. That totally happened, dude. Totally. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> we have to give a shout out to Rochelle for that part because uh, she was brilliant. So. Rochelle, come <laughs> take a bow. <laughs> Rochelle, come on, come out, take a bow. <laughs> Rochelle is our floor director tonight. So Rochelle Turner, everybody, turn around. Yay! <laughs> Good job, Rochelle. Thank you. Awesome music. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Good job. I love the um, the effects that you did, Carlo, on the on the, cool. the, the, the muzzle flashes and stuff like that. Yeah. That that really was some hard work that you put I in there. I wanted to touch it up a bit more, but I ran out of time. That's <laughs> <laughs> very good. Very good. Well done on all aspects: acting, cinematography, editing, music. I just everything everything hit uh, good good notes for me. What do you guys think? I loved it. I just yeah. wish we had, you know. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's get Peter an answer. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's great. It was really good. I enjoyed that. It was good and funny. Yeah. yeah. I enjoyed it. It was good. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. yeah. We do another one? It all came yeah. together. It was nice to do something that was actually pretty ultra-violent. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and yet still enjoyable to watch. <laughs> yeah. Everyone died brilliantly. I mean, Carlo, yeah. I mean, yeah. badass, man. Look at him. <laughs> I don't know why I killed that first guy. He was, he seemed pretty innocent. <laughs> he, he, just, he just insulted you <laughs> by being there. And yeah. You just didn't care for him, man. <laughs> it goes like that, I suppose. Yeah. It just, you just like work there. Reason does there have to be a reason? <laughs> It was your daydream. <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks all around for you guys for doing what you did. Is the all-star panel. Yep, exactly. <laughs> I want to thank uh, Locked Canada for letting us come out there. Simon, thank you very much, man. Uh, it was a great place to, to do this, and I hope we get to do it again. I um, want to thank everyone here that's on this. You guys did brilliantly. Uh, I think also all the B Movie Factory members, um, they came out, and if you want to join us, come out and uh, check out this this uh, link down below, and yeah, oh, go to see it's on them too. Watch, Watch. see, yeah, it's hey, on. get that away. <laughs> Putting your links on me, <laughs> and also. Um, oh. If you want to be a, a sponsor of the show or anything like that, just uh, send me an email. If you want to be on the show as, a, as an inspiration, do the same. That would be great. Uh, it really takes teamwork to make this dream work. And uh, I thanks for watching. And uh, good night. Bye. Bye. Big wide shot. Yay. <laughs> Hello. So now you can actually tell me what you really think of the film. It sucks. Oh, God damn. It's awful. So many problems. I know. It's just awful. Uh, director was just a total ass. <laughs> well, the what producer was Camera an ass. Camera didn't hat. work. We had to do it all on an iPhone. Well, yeah. the producer is ass. Hat. Yeah, the producer ass. He hat. has a nice hat, though. Yeah. It's <laughs> <good>. <laughs>
Captain Richard Scorgi and me, his robot Toasty, as we banter on our space station while showing Vancouver independent films and how they are made. Check your local listings for airtimes on Shore TV. See you next time.